Hello everybody, welcome to JD's Journeys. My name is JD and today we're doing the Days of the Week book tag. If you don't know what the Days of the Week book tag is, well, don't worry, I just made it up. So what I'm going to be doing is showing you seven books that are related to each day of the week. So for example, let's say Sunday, let's see, Sunday, the word sun is in Sunday, or Sunday could refer to a religious day. So it could be anything, just anything that's related to that day of the week. First is Sunday. When you think of Sunday, you think of the sun. The sun is hot. What's a hot place? The desert. So a book containing a desert is Dune by Frank Herbert. So of course this takes place on the planet Arrakis where they have to live in a desert environment. Next is Monday, or Moon Day. So, this one was pretty easy to choose, and that is Gardens of the Moon by Steven Erickson. In this book, there is a kind of moon, but it's not exactly orbiting the world. It's just a rock hovering in the sky, but it's a moon. Next up is Tuesday. The French word for Tuesday is Mardi. And what does that mean? Well, it's Mars Day. Actually, it's like that in Japanese, too. So, ah, oh, this one was pretty easy, too. Red Mars by Kim Stanley Robinson. And this takes place on Mars, of course. It's, uh, in my opinion, it's one of the best Mars colonization novels. I love this book. Next is Wednesday, and this is also a very easy one. Uh, Wednesday in French is Mercredi which of course stands for Mercury, and the book is Mercury by Ben Bova. This takes place mostly on Mercury, which is a pretty hot planet, I think. But yeah, this book is okay. Uh, I will have a review coming in the future. Next is Thursday. Now, Thursday is named after Thor. However, I don't have any books related to Norse mythology. So I thought, okay, let's switch to Roman and Greek mythology. Of course, Thursday means Jupiter. And in Greek mythology, it's Zeus. So here we have the Iliad by Homer. So Zeus plays a major part in this book. So, of course, I chose this book for Thursday. With Friday, we're getting a little more abstract. Uh, Friday means Venus. And Venus is the goddess of love. So I thought, what book has a really good love story? Well, I thought, why not choose this one? Dragonflight by Anne McCaffrey, which features the love story of Lessa and Flar. And finally, Saturday. Saturday refers to Saturn. And what better book than this one? 2001, A Space Odyssey. Of course, in the book they go to Saturn, in the movie they go to Jupiter. But since we're doing books, we're going to Saturn. So I chose 2001. I'm going to tag five people to do this. So they are Turn the Page, Bald Book Geek, Connor O'Brien, Literary Gladiators, and just to see if he'll do it, Jesse the Reader. Oh, and of course, you can do it too if you like. If you have any comments about my choices, please leave them in the comment section below. And if you like this video, please give me a thumbs up and also please subscribe. Thank you for going on this journey through literature with me. See you in the next video.